What's up, boys and girls? Today, we're gonna react to movie recap or mystery recap. I call it movie recap because that's basically what it is. It's a movie that is sized down to very small time, so you can just kind of watch the movie without watching it in the full length, basically. And today, let's see what today is. Today is old man shed a layer of skin every day, making him 10 years younger each time. This sounds cool as fuck. And I'm watching this all the time. So I was like, why not just upload it on YouTube? So yeah. The movie go. surrounds a washed out film director named Leek. He recently lost his mother, who left him okay. with his father, Yat Hung. The old man has dementia and needs constant care. What? That's dude. I work as a nurse. Dementia is like the worst fucking sick. Like people say cancer. I work with people with cancer also, but dementia is fucked up, dude. It, like after some time, you just don't remember anything and you just die because your body just deteriorates. Basically. It's, it's a fucked up sickness. One night, Leek's father comes to him in wet pajamas, having peed himself for the yeah, time in a day. That's and pretty normal. He drags the poor old man into the bathroom and locks him inside. The right fuck? after, he washes the regret with alcohol and decides to commit the unthinkable. Oh no. I don't know if I can play this on YouTube. Seconds before dying, something strange happens okay. in Leek's apartment. The younger version of his mother appears out of the frick. Oh, she's hot. I would fuck his mom and saves him. Then comes the following morning. Leek suddenly remembers about his father and rushes to the bathroom. Oh no. Yat Hung is slouched down in the toilet, still asleep. Leek tries to pull him back, but is shocked when he realizes his what? father is light as a feather. It turns out that Yat Hung has shed his skin overnight, and the thing Leek just touched is the outer layer of his body. And What? What? What's going on? His outfit. Gross. Still in shock, Leek hears his father's voice arguing with someone outside. He is downstairs, talking to a bunch of youngsters about music and sports. It is a strange... Oh, this is awesome. He hasn't seen his father have a... This is, pr this is pretty cool. Wait, but dementia doesn't go away as easy as that. Like, doesn't his brain still have dementia? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm just... Wondering. Conversation in years. It is almost as if his dementia has been miraculously cured. Oh, okay. He answered my question. Yat Hung and is worried about his health. Yat Hung, on the other hand, seems to remember everything that happened before he was diagnosed with dementia. He even thinks the shedding of his skin is normal, like the seasons. And what? Peeling. A while later, he runs to. How is that normal? If he just goes. And he's younger. That's still not normal. Like, if I shed skin, I was, like, now 16 or 14 or something. Like, I will still think it's weird. The market ...and talks to the sellers as he used to in the past. Maybe they will he explain it. all of their names and can do complex math faster than a calculator. Holy However, shit. However, when he tries to buy vegetables, he is asked to pay off his debts first. Soon, the entire market runs out. Wait, wait, what happened to the mom? I'm sorry for I'm I'm sorry for stopping the video. What happened to the mom in the freezer? After him, because he is indebted to almost everyone. After somehow getting away from them, Leek brings Yat Hung to the hospital. Initially, Yat Hung argues that he is perfectly fine and doesn't need to get checked. But after seeing how beautiful the nurse is, he is ready yeah. to try. The doctor is shown the results from a CAT scan, which shocks him. Yat Hung's dementia has been cured at an unbelievable rate, and it is as if he has aged back 10 years. The doctor thinks Leek is trying to perform an insurance fraud and has brought a different person instead of his father. They were mm. kicked out of the hospital. That's understandable. Leek's questions about his father remain unanswered. In the following scene, the father and son are back home. Yat Hung collects his skin to throw it in the trash, but Leek stops him. He thinks it might be useful in the future. But yeah, dude, I would throw the skin in the trash too. Honestly, like, what the fuck are you gonna do with the skin? Like, is a snake? Doesn't snake change skins all the time? I don't know. Finds it disgusting to save his own skin. Same. Struggle to get I agree. Hold of the skin. Leek's wife, Sasa. Oh my gosh, she's hot. Barges in. She is here to ask Leek if he has signed the divorce papers, but is distracted by the skin. Divorce? She is now sitting on the sofa. Yat Hung doesn't remember Sasa and Leek having marital problems and asks her to stay in the house. However, she's hot Sasa as fuck. is tired of her husband's bad decisions. Moreover, he cheated on her with his high school sweetheart. Why would he why would you cheat on a babe like that? 
The fuck, man? She no longer wants to be with him and orders him to sign Bowl the cut, motherfucker. Leak. Then, Leek and Yat Hung have a long chat about how Leek's life turned out to be this way. The main reason for his failure is his high school girlfriend, Chi Mi. This bitch? On the night when Leek's first film flopped, Chi Mi came to meet him with a cigarette what? in her hand. He needed reassurance, which he found in her love. However, the affair broke. Wait, over this girl? The fuck is wrong with this guy? His marriage and the cigarette burned down the studio he put all of his money on. Of it course, was the beginning of his downfall. Soon after, he received divorce papers. Oh, she's so hot. Then he was beaten up by loan sharks who made him sign a paper that gives them the right to his. The loan sharks always look like yakuza members for some reason. I don't know why. This is not. I think this is Chinese. It's not even Japanese. Sell his organs to make money. Yat Hung feels bad for Leek, but he knows that everything that happened was his fault and no one else's. Yat Hung even blames Leek for pushing his mother to an early death with all of his bad decisions. Leek can do nothing but listen because he knows it is true. Oh. In the morning, Leek wakes up to another piece of skin lying in his house. Yat oh no. Yat Hung has yet again transformed, turning into his younger 40 year old self. Leek what the goes fuck? Outside and finds him arguing with two policemen about smoking rules. Leek helps him get rid of the police and brings him to the stadium where they used to. This is like Benjamin Bottom, just the Chinese or I don't know what country this is from, yeah, Taiwan, I don't know. They reenact the old days when Leek had no problems in his life. For the first time in years, the father and son feel like they still love each other. Later on, they mm, this is nice. someone knocks on the door. It is none other than Leek's high school girlfriend, Chi Mi. She just got oh, divorced dude. and is desperate to get back together with Leek. She Look at that haircut, dude. She looks like a Karen. She tries her best to seduce him, while Leek tries his best to send her away. When nothing works, he holds a kitchen knife at her and threatens her to leave. But before Good boy. That, Sasa arrives Ooh. and finds her husband with the girl he cheated. Oh with. man! To back down or go away. Oh tries to man! Sasa jealous by telling her how Leek used to treat her, while Sasa calls her the other woman. They are interrupted True. by another knock on the True. door. This time, a handsome young guy walks in, who Leek mistakes for Jackie Chan from. Oh, he fucking looks like him. Snake in the eagle's shadow. Self plug. We recapped that too. But the man turns. Maybe I'll watch that. Hung, who has changed his skin for the third time. On being asked where. Dude, he looks so much like Jackie Chan. Jesus Christ. Where the skin is, he says that he left it in the streets because it was trash. Leek immediately runs outside to get the skin back. To him, it is not just a layer. The skin was the best his father has ever been. Weird. After reminiscing about his childhood yesterday, Leek has finally realized how Aww. his father has been in his life. He this is so sad. In every part of the neighborhood, ignoring the heavy rainfall. Then he finally finds it hung on a pole in an alleyway. Leek hugs the skin as his own father and brings it. That, that's that's. I'm sorry, but that's weird as fuck. Back home. By now, Yat Hung is cooking in the kitchen, delighted that he is getting his youth back. This version of him is again not kung fu hustle, motherfucker. When Yat Hung Look at makes him. fun of the Look at him. Of skin, they get into an argument. This reminds Leek of the bad times he had with his father, like when he cheated on his mother and neglected the family. The argument turns into a fist fight when Yat Hung oh. openly admits to cheating. Leek holds him on the ground and is about to hurt him, but he sees his mother's picture in the background and stops. Yat Hung yeah. makes fun of him for being weak and asks him to get out of the house because it is still under his name. Some seconds later, he feels bad seeing Leek cry and shows him a bobby pin that his wife left in the house earlier. Yat Hung wants Leek to pursue Sasa and bring her back into his life. True. That's smart actually from the father. Bring back Sasa, she's hot as fuck. Is unable to do even that, Yat Hung promises to disown him. Instead of going to Sasa, Leek ends up in the hands of the loan sharks. They chain him up and are about to take his organs out. All of a sudden, oh. Yat Hung makes a Jackie Chan style entry. Oh my god, he's even younger. Thumb, no, he's not. But as they hold their weapons to his neck, he does a 180 and pretends to be a passerby. The gangster asks Yat Hung to apologize if he wants to be let. Dude, he's gonna do some. Fucking drunk kung fu hustle shit, dude. 
However, Yat Hung is a strict follower of the saying that sorry should only be said if one feels that way. He tries to get off the hook by puzzling the gangsters, but it doesn't work. They proceed to beat him up while Leek yells in the background. Suddenly, Yat Hung goes through another transformation. His skin tears, revealing no. flesh underneath, and making the gangsters run away in fear. Following that, he climbs up the bar and comes out of his older skin. Leek is shocked to have witnessed a transformation in real time. His father stands naked, covered in a slimy substance in an animal-like form. But he also he gets a new haircut. The chains using the bobby pin, but by the time he is free, Yat Hung has already disappeared. Later at night, Leek returns home to see that it has completely changed into Yat Hung's home from when he was in his 20s. He Wait, what? He was working for the Chinese airbase in the war and was recently married to Leek's mother. Oh, it is Yat a Chinese movie. He has to go to Hong Kong to get his wife back. Leek realizes he doesn't remember her death and tells him the truth. Yat Hung's heart breaks for the hundredth time as he crouches down in a corner. After that, he takes his son to the final flight that he piloted. The father and son enjoy flying for a while before they crash. This what? crash actually happened in the past and caused Yat Hung to lose 50% of the vision in his eyes, which is why he had to retire. They return to the apartment, where Yat Hung continues telling the stories of the past. All of a sudden, 20-year-old Leek's mother barges into the room. What? What the fuck is going on? Alongside the house, Yat Hung's imagination has manifested his wife as well. She begins cooking noodles for them. Wait, he can now manifest people? What the school? What the fuck? Okay, here's what I think will happen. The son actually has some condition himself. Or like, there's something with the son and not with the father. And the smell of it makes all the skin come back to life. Leek also turns into the his The fuck is going on? And invites all versions of his father to eat. As this movie descends into the deepest pits of hell, they sit around the table like a family and enjoy the meal together. All Yat Hungs blame each other for how their life turned out and come to the conclusion that the 30-year-old Yat Hung who cheated on his wife was the worst version of them all. In the end, mm. they all have to go to the toilet at once. Leek turns back into his older version and thanks his mother for everything she has done. He wishes her goodbye with tears in his eyes, Aww. knowing that she has come to him to show him the right path in life. Suddenly, an earthquake hits and their house flies into the, the, the This is too much. This is too fucking much. What the fuck is going on in this movie? Sky. Leek looks at this is ridiculous. His father enjoying a plane ride. He finally feels like the person that he was before his life took a turn for the worst. In the following scene, Leek sits by his father, who huh? is on his deathbed. Everything that happened in the past week feels like a realistic dream to him. Yeah. In his heart, he knows that it was reality. It was his parents reminding him he still. Maybe it was a dream or some kind of inception thing, or like you live in a different reality or something. I don't know. Has reasons to stay alive. Eventually, Yat Hung passes away and no. remembers him as the man who shaped him as a person, not an old man who wet his pants all the time. After that, Leek signs the divorce papers and apologizes no, why? to Sasa for making her life so difficult. She Don't divorce her. Wife to him, and he is the one who failed Fuck, to understand I mean, that. kiss he her. He also reveals that he is going to start directing again, as his friend has gotten him a job at an entertainment company. The loan shark has agreed to receive money in interest, which... Oh, sure. Oh, sure. The loan sharks agree to something. Oh, sure. Might be because he was scared of Yat Hung when they last met. Overall, Leek's life is back on track, and he could not Get be back happy. to the with the girl. This Get back to with the girl. Leek is what Sasa fell in love with years ago. Nice. She makes an airplane out of the divorce papers and accepts There we go. A few weeks later, Leek is on the set of his next big project. He handles several employees under him and is passionate about work. The movie he is working on is called Shed Skin Papa and is based on what happened. To oh him my weeks god. In the last scene, he looks at the set in So you're telling me the person that made this movie is him and this story is actually real? Admiration and initiates the first take. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notifications, and leave- I'm sorry, but th this was absolute garbage. Like, it, it had some, like, the parts where he got younger and younger were kind of fun, but the parts where, like, they sat around the table and just ate in with each other, the different, like, the different fathers, 
and the mother came back like and there was such a like you don't need to go to those lengths like that only shows that you're not a good storyteller because you need to take it so fucking far you could have done some twist on it you know like it it's all in his um, dreams or something like that or in the son's dreams i don't know it was it, it was kind of weird not gonna lie the end was too much too fucking much they went too far but yeah that's my reaction to this movie i hope you liked it and see you in the next movie recap or mystery recap whatever you might call it bye